I got started here in 2018. I was 20 years old and I was having health problems. I think everyone expected me to go to my mom's workplace, but I chose to kind of do everything besides that um, to find other things and no one could really help me. I went to the emergency room a couple times because I was having abdominal pain and irregular bleeding. And then once I finally to start, decided to start here, I found results with my irregular bleeding and pain within two to three days. And then everything was normal within 13 days. So I decided I wanted to help as many people as I could with what I learned here and I asked our office manager if there was a front desk reception spot and I got started and then started going to school to do this so now I'm in school to be a naturopath. So I immediately started seeing pain levels diminish within two days but I also started seeing my irregular bleeding just completely be gone within 11 days total. Um, it was going on about three months. I was losing weight, I had no appetite, and then I came here and everything changed. So your mom's been working here for many years? Since I was 12, yeah. Okay. And I think I just didn't want to come here because I was trying to avoid it, but yeah. <laughs> so I started at the front desk and then um, I decided I wanted to help more people that were going through things that I was going through or just health challenges in general and needed other options. So I figured out what other people here were going to school for and I went to school for it as well. I was actually going to school for nursing at Wayne State at the time and changed my mind. So I was at the front desk for at least a year and a half and then I was the supervisor there. I was training people. Then I decided I wanted to become a patient advocate so I could help people more clinically. And I was going to school for it. So I decided to become a patient advocate and then quickly after realized I wanted to be Dr. Schmidt's assistant. So I've been his assistant now for three years total. So I was going to school for nursing, but I also had an interest in psychology. But I've learned like while I was just while working here that it has a lot more to do with diet and nutrition and supplements. So I'm just going to help everyone and just see what they come to me with okay. needing. Yeah. I think the exact moment was probably when I realized how many people I could help. And um, actually one of your patients, I realized like how life changing you are doing for them. And so I was like, this is not just a preventative health care. It's actually life like lifelong and um yeah norma definitely changed that for me oh really yeah <laughs> yeah, that's a, yeah. That's a big deal. she was a hard one but yeah. she definitely changed things for me yeah so do you remember that exact moment definitely yeah, that, yeah. Sorry, tell me that exact moment so yeah, i think i was just in the room with you and realizing that it had nothing to do with like everything that she had done medically and chemo wise it was just everything to do with diet and that growing up she actually was really healthy and that if she wasn't it would have changed probably everything for her and she probably would have passed away along a lot sooner yeah. like significantly sooner so i think that her pathway growing up she was super healthy and then she came to you pretty much healthy and so then once i met her and she kind of showed me that diet changes everything no matter the diagnosis that you have I was like okay <laughs> like that proves it yeah if nothing else that definitely did I think I definitely learned a lot from her I know that our childhood diet growing up was not like normal people I know that we had no cereal in the house no pop tarts nothing like sugar filled um, and I thought that was very weird at the time but in looking back I'm very glad and um, I don't think I knew at the time really how much she was helping me. Um, but now that I know, and now that I've been tested and don't have parasites compared to a lot of people that do, I'm very glad. <laughs> yeah, very glad that I was here. <laughs>